taking a look at what defense responsibilities away from the puck are in their own zone, we're going to take a look at this defenseman right here. So the puck is right here right now. It's going to end up right here, and that player is going to take a shot. But if we're watching this player, he's not worried about the puck because his teammates are going to do their job. He's got to trust that they are going to do their job. He has to find open players on the other team going to the net. In that case, it's this player. So let's take a look at what happens here. D-man ties up his stick. Look at that. This player in white has no chance of getting any kind of rebound because the player in green right here has his stick tied up perfectly. We'll watch this clip a couple times. Also driving the net, we got to make sure that we are taking the opponent's stick off the ice whenever we can as well. If their stick's not on the ice, you can't score a goal most of the time. See how he just lifts his stick right there? We'll see this again. Stick lift right in front of the net, and that player will have no chance to get a rebound. Now we're going to take a look at what happens if you don't do that. Watch right here. Player in white is puck watching. Just watching here. He's not aware of what's going on behind him. And this player comes in. Stick's not tied up, and it's in the back of your net. Again, 58 white, just watching the puck, not taking the man that's right behind him, and it ends up in the back of the net. So make sure that we're not always puck watching. You're looking around the ice, trying to find guys who are going to the net and tying up their sticks as best as you can.